Alright, let's tune you down just a tad so we don't have a weird loop. Looks like we're audible. Hooray! It's everything we wanted. Hi, everybody! Uh, welcome back to the Saturday stream. Kitty, we're gonna be a cat! Uh, this is, uh, oh no. Okay, there we go. Showed an empty file from it. I was worried we lost our save. We did not! Just took a moment to load in. There we are. So, this is us. We're a cat. Um, we're a cat named Kaho. We're actually a priestess of Lun, but we've been turned into a cat after beating Lubella, the, the, uh, the Witch of Decay, I think is her formal title. I don't know. It's hard to tell. She's gone now, so it doesn't really matter, I guess. Uh, that's where we are. Got a decent amount of map. Map completion, 37%. Never mind. Forget what I just said. Uh, kitty sleep. Best idle animation in gaming, possibly. It's, it's up there. This and the Sonic Foot Tap, I feel like, are both pretty iconic. Anyhow, um... So, yeah, we are, uh, we're back at it again, the Christmas Cube. We've got one of the four fragments of the Karst Crest. Uh, right, yeah, try to say Karst Crest more than twice in a row and see if you don't get tongue-tied. Anyhow, point is that, uh, let me it again. The point is that we're now after the other three so that we can open a secret door and meet with the queen and uh, talk to her about the curse that has befallen the town and is bringing the dead back <coughs> excuse me and turning a lot of the citizens into angry ghosts um let's see so we still have our double jump whoop no no I died I hate that it makes a tiny squeak noise uh, I was testing to see if I can attack a cat form the answer is yes actually hang on so you only get like a frame of it, but Kaho's normal sword thing is a leaf that she uses as a weapon. And I just realized the cat has it in its teeth. That's so cute. Okay, anyway. <clears throat> I had to geek out a little bit about the cat. We got this right at the end of last stream and we didn't really get to enjoy it at the time. We're gonna get lots of opportunity to cat around. Up we go. Hey, Mox, welcome. You were just in time for cat. Ah, that jump. And we're back where we started. Listen, eventually I'll get this whole platforming thing. I've been playing a whole bunch of platformers lately, and you'd think I'd be better at them, and you would be wrong. There we go. Beautiful. Uh, we go down, we go over. Oh, is she gonna throw the thing? Hooray! Alright, that's you down. Uh, why is there extra space over- Oh! That's why there's extra space over here. Hi? Hello? Okay. I don't have a talk option. I just can't force a talk. Can't use items in this form either, which is unfortunate. Um, kind of don't want to hit you, but I don't have any other interaction. Let's see. Okay, I don't have my bow, obviously, in cat form. That does make sense. I'm going to try and strike this individual. Um, we'll just do it once. You know, just a love tap to wake them up. Mm, ooh, new horn, go home. No horn, no horn, go home. Okay. Uh, okay, so I need to get a horn. Ow, time to just wrong. The tiny little pain squeak is the worst. That's so bad. Okay, I can't go back the way I was. That might have been a mistake. Whoop, up, up, up. <sighs> Tell you, man, these one block things. There we go. Uh, so, problem that I usually have in platformers with sliding off of blocks is slippery controls, where you, you stop but that you don't quite stop. This game doesn't have that. You stop on a dime. So anytime that you see me like sliding off of things, that is 100% me. <laughs> it is... Ow, I keep thinking the statues are alive. Um, it is a an amazingly crisp game. The controls are, are very responsive. Hey, we found a bug! Hurry, bug. Uh, let's hop down and see if we can get Okay, that's actually, that's the crouch animation. <laughs> let's see if I can find that bell again. And by find, I mean return to the one I already know where it's at. Why do you exist? Uh, this is going to be tricky. Here we go. I want to refresh. Since I can't use items. Eh, there we go. So we're just going to do that loop one more time, just so that I'm not at half health when I get there. But now we have a bug. Nope. But yeah, it's just, it's... I've, as I mentioned, I've been playing a lot of platformers recently, and so many of them I end up fighting with the controls as much as, if not more, than the game. This one is, it's been so consistent. 
Yes, just in time. Um, that I, I haven't run into that yet. And it's a hard game, and I've, I've died a lot at it, so like I, I feel like I would be tempted to use any excuse to say, oh no, it's totally the game. No, it's not the game. The game is very, very good. There we go. And I don't mean that in a like Dark Souls fan sense. What's this? Cat Sphere! Is this? I think I remember what this thing is. Yes, okay. So we use this. Uh, how do we alternate? Left B? Left B. Left bumper. <laughs> And then, aha! We're us again. So now we can be cat whenever. Excellent. And now I can use my bellflowers again. I forgot we had seven. That's a lot. Uh, all right. Let's go over and down now. Let's go. Let's backtrack. Now that we're cat form, let's go back. Cause I didn't. We didn't get a crest after being Lubella, and that's messing with me. There's gotta be one somewhere. I think this water is safe. It is good. Go back through this area. Full of ghosts and water. And water ghosts. Aptly named the sub subterranean grave. We're going to go all the way back towards the start. Because I remember there were a lot of cat-only areas that we can now squeeze through. And I want to make sure that we've got all of that stuff before we keep going forward. Because there might be a key or something we need. And I don't want to have to backtrack later. So it's preemptive backtracking. Which probably doesn't actually save us any time. But, eh, whatever. And roll. Boop, 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 boop. And one more. All right. Roll, roll. There it is. Found my roll button. Yep, yep. Very important button. All right. So over to the right. Let's go up. That's right. I wish this room always catches me off guard. I don't know what it is. Go. Don't hit the spikes. Good. And up we go. That's where we saved our friend Ascorn, who has now found his wife. The poor guy. Oh. Ho, ho. She was in the wind-up. There we go. Hey, Christy! <laughs> what an entrance. Uh, I, we are, so far as I'm aware, and I'm, I'm pretty sure this is true, we, we are done with both of the boob fights in the game. <laughs> the boob boss fights. Which are technically kind of the same boobs, because the first one is the familiar of the second one. Um, Mocha just turns into uh, an, an image of Lubella when he gets panicked. Um, which is kind of adorable. But uh, now that we've finished off both Mocha and Lubella, that's that's it for, for that particular type of fight. Yeah, do you have anything new for us? No, same stuff as last time. Alright, just making sure. Right, run out this away. I'm gonna go all the way back. So the red moon, I made a joke last time about it being a bloodstained moon, and it's tripping me up twice as much now that I've played almost all the way through bloodstained. I'm not going to spoil anything, but let's just say the moon being red actually becomes a story-relevant thing in Bloodstained, which is just amazing to me. Alright, uh, let's see. Oh, that's right, we can't go back because that's where we fell onto Mocha, so we have to go over to the right and up to the left. Got it. Okay. Never mind. Shouldn't hit that bell. One of the crests that I'm hoping that we find soon... And for... Ah... Oh. I could jump over that. I was wrong. One of the crests I'm hoping we find soon will actually let you warp when you get to bells. Um, and that'll save us a whole lot of time. It's part of the reason I'm backtracking now, because I, I want to say it's back here somewhere. Because if we can get that, then we can save a whole buttload of time and just warp bell to bell all throughout the map. All right, here's where the night was. Creepy hotel. Still not scared. Good to know. Good to hear. Fast travel is very tech. Yeah, it's uh, it's any game that has fast travel, I'm I'm a fan of it. It is. I would even call it a critique of this game. It, it was a conscious choice for them to make fast travel a thing you had to unlock. Um, so it was certainly like a choice, and I'm not sure that I I would have made it myself exactly, but it does. Ooh. Is this where I need to go? Yes. Just making sure I'm in the right place. Hey, shopkeeper, I remember you. Ring of candor. Nah, don't want it. Oops, wrong way. Right way. Oh, hey, that's okay. We talked to you, I think. We told you to not give up hope. Treating to the bordering forest. Right, so the place that we're going also doesn't have the curse, which is nice. Not that the curse has really affected us. It's just there are monsters. 
There we go. It's still such a pretty game. For being a pixel platformer, they really... They just had so much fun with the art and design for this one, and I appreciate that. Aha! First cat area. So, LB. Cat! And down. That's interesting. Gotta check. What are you? That's gonna hurt us, right? No, it's not. <gasps> um. I don't know what just happened. I. Let's. Thank you, slime block. Thank you, slime block. Uh. I don't know where we are, y'all. Oh, wait, I'm a ghost. I'm a ghost. Hey, it's fine. We're just doing because ghosts. Oh, no. Many sprites. Many sprites. Oh, ducked out of that one by sheer accident. Uh, okay. Let's head left, maybe? Sure. Cat time. We can just stay as a cat, right? No tomato. Bad tomato. I don't know how I avoided the poison on that, but I'll take it. You just, or are you just like randomly spritzing things on the ground? Ha, ha. Ooh, aw. Remember what I was saying about if you see me miss a thing, it's a hundred percent on me. There we go. There we go. No problem. All right, we're gonna ride this one back up. Ghost cat. Up. Hey. And that. Okay, now we do have to become a human. Ah, crest. Nice! And there we go, that's the warp crest. Okay. Y'all, I remembered right. I'm impressed. I'm surprised. I'm shocked. Oop. Tomato? No tomato. This really aren't tomatoes, but... I, it's what I started calling them. It's like the little dudes who are basically all eyeball and throw bombs that I started calling Bomberman Jr. I don't know what their actual name is. Almost jumped right into the spikes. Ow! Oh, that's gonna be bad! Oh, no. Forgot about the Castlevania knockback. All right, let's try that again. That me being a dum dum. Cat. Cat. All right, well, at least now I know this won't kill me. Yeah. Ghost cat. Ghost cat, gonna ghost. That. We can get two for one. Beautiful. And down and down. Over. Just stay as cat and do murder. Ow. Right in the middle of that one. Wasn't that much damage though, so we're okay. Got you right out of the air. <laughs> this one looks so happy. It's just like floating around, dropping weird daggers. I'm not even sure it's hostile. Be cat to do crime. <laughs> yep. Hop. There we go. Hey, Katie, welcome. Go and up. All right, let's try this again. Or crest. Yoink. Don't. Oh, I did the same exact mistake. I hate to see it. Oh, that was clean. All right, and down. All right, now that I know what I'm getting into, I will not make the same mistake. Hey, Xenon! Alright, so we're gonna hop, hop. Yes, alright. Hop, hop, perfect. Oh no. Oh, ho, oh, oh, ho, oh, oh. ho, ho. Almost walked right to my death. Man, that magnet charm works wonders. Cat to do gay crime? I mean, you know, it could be a gay cat. That should be a health increase, I think. Up, up. It is! Irony of ironies. Uh, we got our health back, but now we still have to cross all of those spikes that will kill us instantly regardless of health. Up, up. Oh. It's going to be a hard jump coming up. Back we go. Up, up. There we go. Up, up. 
This is easier without the bombs being thrown at us, though. Oh. Uh, yep. Nailed it. And we're out! Of course, we're not really out until we get to the save point, but everyone knows that. I really expected you guys to pop sooner. There we go. Let's get out of here. And we're gone! Back to the land of living! That was cool! That was a really cool little area. Alright, uh, back to cat. Cat. Save! And we're good. Cat. Alright, well, now that we have that, we can use any bell we want to warp. Let's go try that out. A witch cursed us, and now it is our power. I woke up like this. <laughs> warp. Oh, we have to do it by name. Ugh, that's unfortunate. I don't remember what they're all called. I think this is closest to where we started. Yeah, I think this is closest to where we started. Hooray! Gosh, that's a nice power. That's such a nice power. Boing! What did you sell? So each shopkeeper has, like, one big item, and there was one of them, I think, in the garden that has a $1,000 thing that gives a, a poison effect uh, to your arrows. That's also very nice. The, the closer I am to death, the, uh, the I, I get a berserker effect. But it's 700 money. What does this do? Oh, that's a uh, consumable. What have we currently got? Come back here. Equipment. Ring of Candor. Everyone drops more money. <laughs> uh, we're going to keep the magnet because that's super handy. Charm. What's the ring of candor? I mean, it's a sign when you're secrecy, where that's also very nice. You know what, though? Let's... We've got enough cash. Let's actually start spending it. We'll grab this thing. So we will do this. So enemies won't drop more money, but we'll still be able to... We don't have to hunt down the money. Uh, and now we have a berserker effect. Cool. Let's go and save before I forget and die. Yep. There we go. Boing! And up. Excellent. Two. Three. Ah, ah, ah. Alright. Uh, so we're trying to go... I... I was wrong. Alright, so... Hmm. So we can't warp anywhere, because I was hoping to get down to whatever that is. But we're pretty close. So we go left and down. And then way left. Oh, we missed a spot all the way to the left over there. Alright, hang on. I promise all the words that I'm saying make sense in my head. I need one of those heat maps for where I'm looking. All right, this is about where we came in. Hop, hop. Hop, hop. There we go. And we're in. Hop. Hey. Wrong. Missed it. She's going to throw the thing. That's okay. Where are we at? Okay, there is a bell here, which is nice. Hello, lamplighter. Goodbye, lamplighter. Got about the freaking curse box. Which also apparently disables my magnet charm. That's good to know. Come on, up, please. How? Two, three, four. Come on, curse, go away. Go away, curse. No one likes you. Interesting. So, like, I think this is a save bell that fell down. And I don't know how to fix it. More importantly, this is a dead end, so we'll leave. So that's the that's the money room. That's why it was. That's why I feel like I've been here before, but it wasn't on our map yet. Whoop. There are no enemies here, so I can look at my map. All right, so we go left and down, and then all the way right, and just keep on going down and right, and down and right, and down and right. Cool. Drop. Two, three, and the finale. Into the water. And we swim, for certain values of swim. <laughs> I love all of the the the, uh, the code that I'm seeing in chat. That's pretty great. I'm starting to see like roll 20 macros in here. <laughs> and down. Da -da -da. There's the garden key. Can't believe we spent like half of last stream going... Where's the place I need the key for? And there was only one door, and it was that freaking door. The one that I was like, it can't be this one, it's underwater. 
Firekeeper died, so you can't light the bonfire. Nice. All right, that's where we came out, so we don't need to go back down there. Yes, we want to go straight over. Pikmin! One day I'll, I'll probably look up what the real names for these enemies are. It will not be this day. Bomberman Jr. Cat statue. More. Perfect. Hey. And there we go. Magnet Charm, you are the best. Alright, so we want to go... Let's actually go down. We haven't discovered this square for some reason. Come here. Ladder. Hurry, right, ladder. Oh, because this is the death room. I knew there was a reason. <laughs> and, and, and up. Over. Perfect. Oh! That's why we didn't let the floor go away. That's why we haven't been down this side. Boom. Alright, so over is a dead end, so we go down. Aha! Alright, that's right, you're the one. If we get a thousand bucks, we'll come back and find you. And that's down here, good to know. Igor! <laughs> Monty Moth! Tiny girl with nothing but panties throwing bomb! Wow! Listen, uh, I appreciate all of those headcanon names. I'm not going to use them, but I appreciate them all the same. It's called Lubella, and that is a dead end. Darn, okay. How did I get to the cinder area? Alright, well, even if we can't warp to everywhere, let's save first. Now we'll warp. Let's go to Karst City. So we haven't explored the creepy hotel. Go away, stupid wizard. Uh, Alright, so... Up top left is the, the karst key. We've got two of the four parts of the crest. Uh, oh, there's a door over here that we haven't checked out. So straight across until we hit a wall, and then down one and over. Gonna run into bomber ghosts. Like that one that I just literally ran into. Boing. Thank you, slime box. So over here, right and now, down one and over two. Still not scared. I understand. One day they might say something different. Check yes, wizard. You know that's that one's accurate. I'm pretty sure that's canon. Uh, let me check the rule book. Yep, it says jerk ass wizard is actually the canon name. I hate those so much. Yeah, that one. Ah, oh, because of that, that freaking auto aim that they have. Widow aimbot. Alright, that did something? Oh, there's another one. Alright. Yaha! Oh no! I don't want to get Indiana Jones. Alright, keep going. Boom. Upper! Go tell Hound. There you go. Hey, you! Stop throwing things! It's rude. Green box. Sure, okay. Cat! Cat hole. Let's go cat first, and then we'll double back. Ah, uh, can we swipe? Well, that is a cat hole, but is it a one-way cat hole? Is that a thing that exists? I didn't know that. Can I roll through? Nope. All right, never mind. I haven't seen a one-way cat hole before. Oh, no. Haha. Just a little more reach. There we go. Dog. It's the dog I always miss because he blends in with the wallpaper. <laughs> puppies! Sorry, Xenon, I know. It's, they're, they're angry puppies. Go this way. Use the garden key. Where's the garden near here? I guess this maybe gets to the garden? Sure it does. Look at that. Immediately gets to the garden. But this is part of the garden we haven't been to, apparently. Oh, bunny! I thought we talked to you already. Maybe then I died and didn't save. This is the ivory bug bunny. Aww. Poor bunny. Bunny gardener. What kind of ivory bug? A rare collectible bug. Is its full Latin name. Reward you any way I can. Right, well, we got two. I see you found the bug! The bug with the power. We got a second one. Can I just turn them both in individually? 
No, okay, sorry, I must have turned them both in. I think we already, yes, that's a dead end. We already established that is death water to the right of the bunny. <laughs> oh god, Mox, you're right. It's bug bunny. That, I gotta believe that's on purpose. Oh, oh. Sorry, sorry to almost attack you there. I hate that I keep jumping on top of people to talk to them. <laughs> Like Legacy of Cain. The royal court has been ignoring his citizens ever since this kingdom fell to a curse. Ain't that just the way? Don't leave outside. I mean, that's what I'm going to do immediately. Oh, that's right, we talked to you. You are the one who has a... a master who is surrounded by cats. Oh, well, you seem sane enough. Your priest is seeking an audience with the royal court. In the present state, reaching the castle is highly difficult. Yeah, I know, I need four parts of a crest. You won't find help easily in the city. I don't know, there have been a lot of helpful people. My master might be able to guide you. Here we go. She lives inside the city's monastery, surrounded by cats. That sounds like good people. Also, I kind of hope we have to turn into a cat to meet her. That would be great. Okay, we're running into a lot of talky bits, and that has me, like, weirdly anxious. Yeah, I gotta stop doing that. A neophyte? Do you seek salvation? Oh, so I guess so like we're we're the traveling on the road priestess, and these are the like actual cloistered ones. Just based on all the same class. You can achieve salvation from eternal damnation by donating to Saint Esselin. Oh good, we're doing indulgences. That's great. Recommendation of at least fifteen monies. It, you know what, whatever, we got the cash, let's see what it does. We are thankful. May you find peace. Sure not going to do it with 15 bucks. You're a small minority now that Her Highness propagated her destruction. Most of the population has lost faith in the gods. Hey, it's polytheistic. Catholicism. She's to blame for all that is wrong right now. That seems a little harsh, but, I mean, maybe. Oh, there's a lot of y'all. Hi. St. Eslin is absolute. His wish reigns supreme. Oh, I don't like this religion already. You're safe here with us. I mean, no one's attacked me yet, so that's good. That's it, huh? <laughs> hey, look, everyone! We found Link undercover! <laughs> he, he was hiding in the monastery the whole time. <laughs> hey, Link, how you doing? How's the new game going? Link, you looking forward to Breath of the Wild too? Ah, oh, such a kidder. Oop. Bell. I like your bonnet. Who are you? Prayers have been heard. The Witch of Decay and her demons have been vanquished. You're welcome. <laughs> yeah, yeah! <laughs> little by little, the voice of the gods pierced through this kingdom shrouded in darkness. Still, for this convent to go against her highness's wishes, it is a disgrace to the name of our lord. Ugh. Kindness knows no bounds. If you so desire, should protect even a heretic from Lund, such as you. Wow, why everyone so rude? That is a floating skull. You're probably not going to be talked to, huh? It's a shame. Ow! Ow. Okay, so floating skulls explode and curse you. That's not grand. Et da da. <laughs> <laughs> like a kingdom heart. It's true. Uh, let's see. So there's an up and a down and a right. There's an every which way. Let's roll back for just a mo. Now that we know what the skulls do. Uh, let's go up first. Sure. Up, up. There we go. Uh, oh, elevator. It's a chair. Is it? No. All right. It's a, a two-level cathedral, at least? Whoa! Oh, that's a spike. I honestly couldn't see it at the bottom of the screen for a second there. I thought it was floor. It was not floor. It was... It was spike. Hop, hop. And there are jerkwad wizards, but I still want to see what's over here. The jerkwad wizards will not deny me. And we're back through. All right. This time, let me not be staring at the stained glass. I see you trying to knock me out of the air. I don't appreciate that. Oh! It's a pretty painting! 
I wonder which of the many, like, weirdly identical nuns that one was. Oh, you're one of these guys. So some of the jerk ass wizards just do this, like, column of whatever. That's a red barrel. Okay, yeah, it was a red barrel. Oh, that's a lot of red barrels. Uh, da -da. Let's not be next to them. And now that you're clear, hep, hep. that would have been clever. <gasps> Bomber ghost. You almost got me. That was well done. Yep. Yeah, that, that's what I did. Ah! Um, I haven't seen you before. Okay, good. Just keep walking. We got them both. Oh, I think I got that guy right before the thing that he cast in the air was coming back around. So we timed that just right. We got a tainted missive. Love that song. Temporarily increases attack by 100% at the cost of hit points. Okay. That could actually combo with the Necklace of Sacrifice. What is the Backman pad? We never use this thing. <laughs> Summon several back blocks. No idea what that does. So I did learn last time, uh, after going on the internet, which is always a mistake, don't do it. Um, but I did it, and I learned that apparently there are special items that you get from the bosses, but only if you beat the boss without taking a hit. Uh, and so the the Backman patch... Can I go up the stairs? Ah, uh, Is from beating Lubella's uh, familiar without getting hit, which is kind of cool. Is this a dead end? It is a dead end. Still like the bell, though. The bells! There, okay. Okay, the big guy's not back. Good, that's good. Alright, so the big guy that was guarding the tainted missive apparently was like a mini-boss? Except I don't know what he was guarding. Whoa, no. This worked last time. There we go. Can't shoot through the wall. Ah, uh, hmm. Well, this is awkward. Can't jump up through the dog. <laughs> hey ho! <laughs> Sorry, hey ho, you're, uh, uh, the name reminded me of Steve from the Borderlands promos. And through we go. That is correct information. I'm glad to know the internet didn't lie to me. It does that sometimes. But I was trying to figure out, because I, on my first playthrough, I did not get the Backman patch, and I'm like, what is the, what is the deal with items? How do item, ow, work? What I get for checking the map, and I should be fighting. Uh, I tried to dodge, but I didn't land in time. There we go. We'll get air dodge soon. In fact, we really ought to get air dodge before we go through that door. I don't know if we can go through that door. Is that the monastery key door? Let's find out. Ow. Y'all are still dangerous on the ground. Yes, okay, that's the monastery key door. We don't have the monastery key. Down we go. We could use a bell. There's one on the way here. Yep. Jump! And down. Come on. There we go. No skull. Bad skull. Alright, so last time we went up. This time we'll go right. Dog. Double dog. There we go. Uh, that looks like another cat area. Cat. Down. Eh, it's over here. There's water. That's cool. Uh, can I fall through here? No. Oop. Nope, that's just fog. <laughs> hmm. I wonder what that does. Come back to you. I probably have to find like a switch. Do a funny thing there. Uh, I appreciate it, Halo. I will. Ooh, I will keep an eye out for that one a little bit later. But I appreciate it. Still cursed and lots of bombs. Uh, oh, this is just a run. Sometimes the oldest Super Mario tricks are the best. Hello, shopkeeper. Funny as in a glitch. <laughs> uh, that I would rather skip. But thank you though. You're just here to bat at water. Yeah, I mean, it's kind of what we ended up doing. I'm I'm confident there is something there. You know, given how often we've been cursed and poisoned, this might not be a terrible idea. Nah. We'll save that one. I'm still saving up for that, uh, thousand. 
All right. The crossroads. Lots of crossroads over here. Oop, oop. Yeah. I don't trust y'all at all. Let's double back. Actually, what's, what door? Or what key? Ha! Okay. It's not even locked. It's just... Huh? Ow. Double wizard. All the way across the sky. What does it mean? Yeah. All right. That felt good. Nice. Health upgrade. Doink. Thank you. Go away, ghost. Hey, hey. Not quite fast enough. Too close. Sorry, we're going back past the save point. We can just burn all of these. I don't think I had this many bellflowers the last time I came through here. Because I'm definitely able to be a lot more cavalier with them now. Bomb ghost. Double bomb ghost. Oh! It's the cat lady! I love your wizard hat, and I... Those are probably, like, Ofudas hanging off them, as opposed to, like, tassels, but... Who knows? Just an unfamiliar face to this monastery. Look at them all! The one sleeping, and there's the one that's black with red eyes. I like that one. That's my favorite. Devout from Lun. You can call me Cotillard. Aww. You have met with Paramol? Apparently so. I remember... <laughs> ki ki ki. Wow. Now I'm concerned. Anybody who laughs like ki 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 you should be worried about. Unless it's the bats from Final Fantasy 1, but otherwise... That is how you laugh. It's not inaccurate, though. So you are concerned about your homeland. Indeed, the darkness assaulting your people hails from here. And yet, you seem pretty chill in your cat library. The queen has become possessed by a malevolent greed. I remember that Full Metal Alchemist arc. She's the one responsible for many casualties, not only here but in other lands too. Again, but oh god, her eye went red. It's fine, everything's fine. Perhaps you should head to the castle. Just don't expect kindness from those who live there. Okay. Vaguely threatening. Have to find the way on your own. I know the way, I just need the things. Oh, nice. <laughs> it's dangerous to go alone. Take this. Careful, she's a circling in a moe suit. <laughs> Katie, that's terrifying, and I love it. Hey, monastery key. Okay, now we can get into the, the boss door. Oh, we're totally changing into a cat in the cat library. Okay, let's see what happens. Be careful, it's been only a year since all of this started, but most of our population is completely degenerated. Yee. By that, you mean that they're, like, like turned into ghost stuff, right? Not that they're, like, or something. Hello, fellow cat. It is I, a cat. How do you do, fellow kids? Nope, oh, but... Can I jump up on the thing? I want to jump up. Okay, I heard one of them meow. Aw. Just like when I'm an actual human, they ignore me. Ah, so it goes. Oh, this is good. Uh, can I talk to her as a cat? Let's find out. Yes! <laughs> what an adorable little cat you are! I really hope she doesn't end up keeping us. That could be awkward. Sarah's been declared forbidden by the nobility, so it's refreshing to see an outsider. Aww. Perhaps she should head to the castle. Right, you told me. Okay, so we could just start this whole conversation as a cat, and that's amazing. Hooray! Here for this exclusive cat content. <laughs> Meow do you do, Christy, that's amazing. There we go. Whoop. Let's save. Alright, so we have the key. I still wanna go I think we go here. Run. Just keep running. Whoop. Stay away from the boom barrels. Whoop, no 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 no. Whoop. Just avoid. Just avoid. I feel like there's got to be something there, but I don't know what it is. I'm gonna try. I'm gonna do this one more time. Now that we visited the cat lady, I have the monastery key. Can I go through? Is there a floor here? Nope. There's not a secret floor below. You could jump up. Is there a? Is there an ivory bug? Is there supposed to be a bug here? Maybe. Ah, who knows? Hop, hop. It does seem like a very ivory bug place, but apparently no. 
So now we'll go down. Oh, hang on. Yep. Blocked. Okay. Yep. Down we go. Lots of detours on this ladder. Oh, that's a lot of money. That seems painful, right? After a while, you'd figure that would hurt. There's not really fall damage in this game, so I could just jump down, but the sound of that one is so much funnier to me for some reason. Probably need to come back when you get more bombs. Thanks, Christy, that's helpful. <laughs> okay. Didn't even see those flying daggers until we were all through them. Good to note that for next time. I'm sure we'll be back this way at some point. Oh, hello. I don't even know what you do, but if I can attack you, you're probably bad, so... Go, Bobberman Jr. Bomberman Jr. has a little scarf under the eyeball, and that raises all kinds of questions. Alright, we've been over there. Don't check the map when you're being bombed. We haven't been up there. We went through there in the playthrough where we died and then didn't come back. Because I remember the cannon with the wig on it for some reason. Ow. It does a lot of damage and is very tough. Let's do this for the map completion. Thank you for staying stunned. Alright. Up. Okay, we've been here. Good. And down. Now we're just going to avoid y'all and run. You're easier to kill than avoid. And down. Hooray! And down, and we're down. All check. Alright, we've been in the connecting area down here. Oop. Try not to fall straight down in case there are spikes, as there so often are. Eh? Yep. Eh. Nope. No. Eh. Nothing. Whole bunch of nothing. Oh, that's... Those are big mace-like things, huh? Let's find out what key you use. Crap. One we don't have! <laughs> uh-huh. Wow, you're slow to move, huh? through. Fair enough. That's a, a new color of Bomberman Jr. Stop. Nope, we can... I hesitated for just a moment too long. Oh, that was close. Lamp lighter. No, oh, please. Closer. Yeah. Okay, there's an up that we missed. Can we get to it from here? Okay, uh, hop. Ah! Thank you, slime box. To go to there, to go to there, to go to there, to go to there. Hooray! Figured it out. Oh, no, lamp lighter. Wait for you to... Can't really wait for you to turn. Once you've seen me, it's too late. Yeah, you're just gonna sit there forever. Well, I can do this, then. Ah! Oh, that spikes. Up. Up. Eh? Eh? Right, apparently we can fall from above here, but otherwise... Up! Oh. oh! And there's that. Lots of spikes down here. Wow, just... Just bombs for days. Shopkeep! What an, what an interesting location for a store. Huh. You got a lot of business down here? Red ring. Passive effect restores a small amount of HP per kill, but enemies won't drop money. For 400, and we have the ring of candor. Uh, we're at 700, which is close to the poison arrows thing. I'm going to save it. But this is another thing to save up for. That's, give me that again. Was that 500? We can, we can get 500 again. Because that'll be handy to have... Ow. Yeah, there's no way I was... Ow. Get out of that one fast enough. They're just bombing each other now. Let's... Oop. Ha ha ha. And... Straight down from here. 
Why did we stop going to... Oh, that's right, that was the locked door. We don't have the key for. <laughs> there we go. We've got left from here. Hello! <laughs> it's a spider we can talk to! <laughs> Wanna buy? Drilling arrows? Arrows pierce their enemies, that's fantastic. Impurity flask. Restores hit points whenever the user is poisoned. Okay, we've avoided poison pretty well, but drilling arrows is even, it is at least as good as the, the poison arrow thing. So we're grabbing that. Is that a thing we have to equip? Probably is. Yeah, it is. Darn, okay. Well, hang on to that. We might we might swap that in for uh, for boss fights. Or just, you know, bad enemy rooms. Bell. Alright, so from here... That looks boss roomy, doesn't it? Uh, we did just save, though, so it's an ideal place for a boss room. But I'm curious what's down here. Hooray! Move. It's over here. Woo. Oh, that was cool. <laughs> That's a health upgrade. Oh, the spikes go through. Okay. Run. Health upgrade. Is something over here? Cinder key! Nice. I might go to that door we can't open. <laughs> Stop. The spikes to cycle. Ow! Thought I waited. At least those are, are not instant death spikes, so that's a nice touch. And we're through. Yep, there we go. Alright, well, that was a worthwhile detour. Move. Yeah, let's check to the right, just in case. Why always the spikes? Up. Okay, go back up and save. Up. Up. Dong. My nemesis, two inches of water. That's a mimic! Right, let's try that again now that I know what I'm walking into. Uh, 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 uh. Refresh. Hep, 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 hep. Hep, hep. Aw. Okay, so we can't. Ow! Can't just avoid the mimic. Good to know. Stupid one inch of water. One more time. It's important to, to always be learning. Went too early. Yay! Alright. We can deal with one battle flower. Boom. That's a lot of kaboom. Let's get rid of the kaboom. I don't trust it. It's more likely to blow me up than anyone else. Let's see. Oh! Kath's sister, Catherine. Oh no. Well, it's a boss fight where she's already on like, ooh, three quarters health, so that's cool. Ooh, no, no, no. Well, we ran into the fire mage. Let's help Catherine out here. Move. Oh, she has a whip. She's a Belmont. Move. Yeah, huh? Fine, everything's fine. Oop, nope. Run. And good, everything's fine. Ah, forgot the flames. The lingering flames. Oop. Oh. I hate it when I oh, move. I hate it when I see it coming and I just don't hit the button fast enough. There. Yeah, okay. Move. Move. Alright. It's going badly. It's going very badly. Out of the way. I remember to stop underusing the bow so much. Well, now that we're done with that. Oop. Oh. I have. Let's charge it up. There we go. Whoop. Yaha. Right, apparently when she's in the charge mode, at least, she can be stunned. 
healing. That's cool. Boop, boop. We're out of healing. So, yeah. Oh, this is bad. We're one hit from dead now. Now we cheese. He's also very close to dead. Nope. Yeah! Barely. Just barely. Hi, Catherine. I met your sister. She, uh, didn't think I would make it this far. Thanks for resistance. Are you hurt? Oh, so very much. Can you heal me? My first time seeing a sacred leaf in action. Certainly an interesting way of fending off enemies. Uh, you know, it, uh, it doesn't always work for us. Since you're still around, perhaps you'll hear me out. I mean, sure. Good. I've suspected something was amiss up there at the castle. The queen I once served was noble and caring, but now she's turned into a morbid figure. Everybody has a goth phase, it's fine. Anything under her direct control is lost, so I've deserted her order of knights. Nice! Here's my proposal. Taking down the queen. Sold. Already halfway there. You mentioned her curses reached your homeland. Let's assume I mentioned that. Should you choose to side with me, you're going to need a special crest. Okay, this is just telling us what we knew. Split into four pieces. One of its fragments should be around here. I hope so. Once you have the four parts, head to the locked door at the entrance of the city. Got it. Cool. What else do you have to say? Seems we don't have many alternatives. We have to behead the lovely queen. Aww. Should you choose to side with me, you're going to need a special... Okay, good. And this is all the same stuff. Just in case we forgot. Which is, you know, is handy. Uh, what do you think the chances are there's a bell in this room? Well, that's the crest, though. So let's chance it. Maybe they'll be nice and there won't... <gasps> bell! I was about to say, maybe they'll be nice and there won't be enemies in here. Yeah! Three out of four! <gasps> yes! Midair dodge! Now we can take on the last boss and actually have a chance. <laughs> so I think I mentioned it during our first stream. One of the things that I, I love about this game, but which really kind of threw me the first time that I tried to play it, um, is that there's not a fixed order, hi, um, that you can do the various areas and the various bosses in, not really. Um, you're going to hit Mocha first regardless, after you hit the Centarpede. But uh, after that, you have pretty much free roam, which means you can do the major bosses of the crests in any order. The second one I did is so much easier with midair dodge, which I did not have when I attempted it. So this time around, hopefully, she will be a, uh, uh, you know, not a seven fight kill for me like she was the first time. All right, where are, that's where we had the door. I guess the cinder key we picked up down here goes with that. It's the only cinder area I know of. There we go. It's up. Bomb. Please tell me that the first overarching storyline in this game was to light two great fires. <laughs> uh, no, so far it's still it's the crest thing. Move. Got it. Next. Boing. All right, we go. All right, so there is an up there. And then there's the left. I don't think we can do the up. I think that's a fall down as opposed to a, a ride up. I kind of want to just cat under these. I think we figured out we can roll this cat, but this saves me on height. There we go. Up we go. Do, 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 do. Nailed it. Alright. Cat killed the cat statue. Let's go ahead and finish you off before we get over there. Now, cat. Hooray! Woo. One for you. Health! Health. Apparently, we can only get health as a human. <laughs> eh? Ah. Switch? Don't know what that does. Move. I want to fall into the spikes myself. Be a terrible way to go. Done. Run right back. Run right back. Oh! That's what it did. Switch turns off the maces. Cool. Alright, back up. Oh. 
Try that again. Alright, so... Up and to the right, I think, is that elevator. Up again. Nope, missed it. Boing! Boing! <sighs> really? <laughs> Let's try this from the ground. There we go. I'm too cavalier with my double jump. Aha! Coming through. Bomb. Yeah, to the right, I think. Ow. I forgot those were firebombs. In a place called, like, the Cinder whatever, you would think I would remember that they were firebombs, but no, apparently you would be wrong. I think I can go up this one? Yes, because this is where we came down, that's right. This will be the Ladder of the Ages. We're going to be on this ladder a while, so everyone get cozy. So now we have the Monastery Key from the Cat Lady, which we can use to open the other boss door for, I think, the fourth and final part of the Cursed Crest, which is still hard to say, no matter how many abilities you have. How is everybody else's Saturday night? Uh, I'm just doing, you know, regular Kaho things, just climbing a ladder for three years. Hey, it's the first side room. Just one more of those to go. Uh, boy, this, this probably wasn't the best way to go up, huh? That's alright, you know what, we'll get there. This is like this is like riding an unpowered rail in minecart or in Minecraft, but up a hill. Right, so if we go here. Nope, sorry, I didn't mean to attack you. I did attack you, I just didn't mean to attack you. Alright, we'll save. If I go to warp, is it the same? Okay, well now I've got Subterranean Grave, Four Low Monastery, Karst City. Okay, so we, we picked up one more uh, fast travel place, which is nice. Straight up and to the right. So we're actually very close. Go away, Skull. No one wants you. So we go up here, take the elevator. There. Up. None for you, Dark Wizard. Monastery key. There's not a closer save point, is there? Nope, that's it. Alright. Ooh. We can go cat again, yeah? Yes, we can. Whoop. Skull. That's the safe one I wanted. No skull. Bad skull. Oh, there she is. The queen destroyed this kingdom's faith. This convent, our abode. It's all that's left for those who pray. I love the dramatic head turn that she does. Maiden in white. Okay, that's making a bit of an assumption. That's making two assumptions, actually. You are not one of us. Well, okay, that's fair. I'm from out of town. Perhaps you're siding with the queen? Oh no, she's paranoid. I hate to see that. Look at what she's done to this kingdom. I have! I've been fighting through it. Do you know what it took for me to get here? Oh, and she has a bloodsword, because of course she does. My duty to expunge. Expurge? Expurge. Is expurge a word? I know expunge is a word, I know purge is a word. Is expurge a word? Alright, let's take a moment. It is a word, how about that? Uh, turning into a cat probably won't help us here, which, believe me, I say with a great heap of sadness. Uh, okay, so we want that. Magnet stone won't really help us. Let's do that. Yeah, purge, I feel like, is... Yeah, why would you use expurge when purge is right there? Or expel, or expunge. Um, which is a Unix command, but also like a helpful thing. All right, we're gonna have to come out of this and immediately dodge. We do. Oop. There's her. And then backflip. So she does lightning and oh, also that. Well, that doesn't actually do that much damage. That'll do curse if we're standing in it. Oh, I did it. I got too close to it too soon. We can wait it out though. This is early on. So we're okay. There we go. If we hit her just at the right time coming out of that, we can stun her like that. It's helpful. Move. Oh, air dash is so nice. Ooh. All right, we have our items back. Oop, move. Oh, didn't expect her to lightning on top of herself. I think she has her second phase at 50%. 
Well, no, it's almost impossible to. Ah, oh, darn it! I rolled right into it. Ah, oh. you hate to see that. There it is. That's phase two. All right, now things are gonna get ugly. She's gonna do this and then spin. Just, I'm just, I'm just dodging for time at this point. So we get that back. Now we need to start doing damage. Okay, that actually wasn't. Ooh. We're doing okay. Well, less so now. Try not to dodge into your opponents, kids. Pro tip. Or ah, I've gotten cursed every single time. That is the one thing that I learned from the first time I played her, ah, played against her, was to try to not get cursed. I think I could send her out of the air, actually. That's new. Oop! Lightning. She's gonna come and dodge there. Move, move. Nope, oh, nope. That was a mistake. That was a big mistake. Use it. Yep. I used the wrong item. I meant to use the 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 Bachman patch, and uh, I had it in the second spot. We're gonna take just a moment and kill this guy and then uncurse ourselves, and then we're going to switch up our equipment. Now that I know which room that they're in, we're going to switch this one up, do a little bit of do -si do There we go. All right. There we go. So Backman will be our second, so we don't have to go through. Partner Fennel is a very Dark Souls name. It is. It, it very much is. I mean, Derelict Frida is also there, considering that she's basically a giant ghost crow. This game wears its influences on its sleeve, and I appreciate that. All right, here we go again. We did okay. We got her down to like a third, considering all the mistakes I made. Wow, I didn't think I landed inside of her that time, but I did. One thing that I have the hardest time with on Fennel um, is figuring out which attacks are going to stun her and which aren't. So sometimes I'll walk in thinking that I'm going to get the knockback, and I don't. And it messes me up. Uh, I know in the middle of the lightning is one of them. And like right after, yeah, there we go. Right after she jumps back is another one. Alright, already phase two. This is good. This is very good. Oh! Didn't think she could hit me out of that. Whoop. Okay, so we can stun her out of the middle of that one, but only sometimes. Move, move! And also, learning that on the second phase, on that spin move, she can turn around. So getting behind her isn't always the way to go. There we go. Oop. Under a quarter. Curse. Oop. Don't know what that would have done. Apparently that! <laughs> Holy crap! Hey, y'all, that was the Backman patch. <laughs> Never used that before. <laughs> Long wind-up, but worth it. Huh. So, um... That was partner Fennel. Uh, rip, I guess. Wow. Okay, second try, but that was... That was rough. That was rough. Okay, well, we're very, very close. Magneton summon. <laughs> basically what it was. It will not have me after that fight, Skull. I refuse. Okay. Woo. Forgot about this room. It's good for you to come back. Doesn't matter that I'm cursed here. Well, it kind of matters that I'm cursed here because now I can't turn into a cat. This is dangerous. I'm going to leave this out of my inventory until I really want to put it there. I can air dash now, so I could just... Well, if I air dash now, I'll go right into the falling blocks, which I don't want to do. hey ha hey hey Nice. Door open so I can kill this wizard. There we go. It will not have me ghost. 
Oh. Thank you, double jump, for saving my life. Almost went in the spikes. Just running all the way back. And it's this wizard. Goodbye. Don't stand next to an explosive barrel, you jerk. Got you in time. Yes. Alright. Uh, what I need... I just realized I went the completely wrong way for. Because this is a dead end. What I need is a bell to go all the way back to Karst City. There, well, I'm invisible and you're or invincible and you're not. We'll go ahead and trigger that. A flower. And up. And down. No nope, dog. Bad dog. Bad facing. Hi, wizard. Bye. Magnet charm, you are my best friend. Uh, elevator? Elevator. Yes, cool. This will go right back to a bell. We could have done this right after the boss fight, but I forgot I had the warp power. Because <laughs> last time I was here, I didn't. Here we go. Can I talk to you again? Yeah. Hi. My lord have mercy on the soul of my poor sister, so she can rest in peace. I think this is partner Fennel's sister. I might be wrong. Is there anywhere in here that we haven't been? I think we've covered pretty much everywhere that we can see. Yep, yep, yep. Okay, we haven't... There's somewhere over here that we haven't been. So let's go all the way back. Warp. I think the grove... Yes, grove is here. Are these statues and portraits of your sad mom? Uh, that's a good question, actually. We don't really know anything about Kaho except that she is a, uh, a priestess of Lun and from elsewhere. Hey, come on. Up. Ow. And uses a maple leaf to fight with because, sure. Eh. Here we go. Made the mistake of thinking I could just walk through the tutorial area. Hello. I don't know why I thought that would work. So here. Oh, it's a cat area! That's what. Okay, we're gonna have to wait. Okay. It should go back up on its own, I think. How about now? Oh, there's a button. I saw the button. Very tiny button. And cat! <gasps> Health! Health! Hooray! Okay, so this time we could get the health as a cat. Last time we couldn't. That's so weird. We did see ourselves as a human after we got it, though, and that's kind of cool. None for you. Ow. Go through this whole area as a cat just to make them feel bad for hitting me. And also poison myself like a dodo. So I can still dodge roll as a cat. I love that that tutorial is just linked to that screen. Doesn't matter when you are in the game, if you run to that area... Karst City. Take me down to the Karst City. I'm sure it doesn't sound like cursed for any reason. She's half Khajiit. <laughs> Which means Kaho sometimes have wear if you have coin. We are still maple leafing as cat, that's true. In fact, we figured out... Let me, let me do this again because it's so freaking cute. It's worth doing every time. When you maple leaf as cat, there's about a half of a frame you can kind of see in the wind-up. She's actually holding the leaf out the side of her mouth. And it's just, it's the best. Cat power, best power. Alright, what do you have that I ignored last time? Nope, hang on, back up. Fairy tier. That's quite nice. We have the Ring of Kendor. That's a usable. Temporarily. Ooh, you know what? We are gonna buy that. We can only buy one. That's a shame. Alright. So the crystal tier, I think, refreshes the way the other ones do. Uh, and will let us, without hurting ourselves, increase our attack. So when we're in a long boss fight and we run out of uh, Bellflower, which is going to happen regularly, then we'll have that to, uh, to still have a usable item. All right. Let's see how this goes. Ding. Headed out. Have a wonderful Saturday night, y'all. Thank you so much for stopping in. Ha-ha. The doorway opens. Aha! Bad wizard. No biscuit. 
All right, so go. There we go. Left. I just noticed a conspicuous ledge out here to the right. Hup, hup. Secret wall? No. Man, my secret wall finding has just been garbage. You have cat ears. The Royal Pinacotheca. Sure. Are those just eggs hanging out in the background everywhere? I'm concerned. Who are you? How did you get here? I walked. Get out, outsider. That's where outsiders belong, hence the name. You're giving me the creeps. I love that her voice stopped shaking at the end there. Oh, I can hit the eggs. Do I want to hit the eggs? We're going to hit the eggs for a moment. They opened up. I have concerns. Alright, well at least we have this. We have a new warp point, although I think this is kind of like... Oh, that's a... Ooh, that's a pyramid head. Well, I can get this in the meantime. Not what I meant to do, but here we are. Whoop! Birds! Oh god, they're little... They're little Fridas! They're little Frida birds! That's a... And I'm killing them! Because otherwise they would eat me, but they're so cute! Look at... Them. Okay, that's falling away for us. Good enough. I meant to do Bellflower. Turn around backwards. Just a mess right now. I, I've not... Woo. Okay, fireball skeletons. See, we're learning. We're learning things. And uh, we're certainly killing eggs, which is... Uh, they're probably full of babies. Uh, they're probably full of these guys. Listen, no joke, I feel a little bad. I'm not going to stop doing it, but I'm not going to feel bad doing it. Okay, so that was you guys, I guess? Sure. Ow. Yeah, we learned earlier that those things are still dangerous on the ground. Little raven friends! They hop, they pop, they can't stop! <laughs> Box, I love you. Stop making them cute. We're gonna have to kill a bunch of them. Oh no, oh no, oh no! Ah! Oh. Cute invincibility frames. Hi, buddy. What are you doing way out here under this poster of Bill Cipher? Violet Sprite. Quick arrows. 2,000 money for... What does this do? Pocket and Sensory. Adds flame damage. Ooh. That is nice. Active effect. Cast protective dark sorcery. Oh. Vague. I love it. Uh, drastically increases the speed of arrows. Now, is that... Hmm. Drastically increases the speed of arrows. It is an, it, it's an equipable, though, so I don't know if I want to give it up for one of these guys, because these are both very good. I want more passive slots is what I really want. Uh, oh, what does this do? Does not open from this side. Alright. So if we go up and around, we'll probably find that. Uh, we're going to go get this thing. We'll probably die doing it, but we just saved, so that's okay. So we're going to go here. To Ow. Hit my head. I don't know why I thought I could jump through those platforms. I, I thought I had before. But alright, so... Okay, we dodged into it, as opposed to on top of it. There we go. Third time's a charm. Elf fragment. Good. So we don't have to do that. Off the ladder, please. Off, off the ladder. <laughs> and we're up. Uh, okay, more pyramid head. Wow, you take a lot of hits. Whoop. Fireball. Aw. Wait, is that painting coming after me? It's the second game where that's happened. Hi, you're large. Uh. Nailed it on the first try. Okay, I feel pretty good about that. Hep, hep, hep. Nailed it. Air Dash, where have you been my entire life? I love you so much. Before you turn around. Don't. They're like birds on a line. There we go. Evil painting. Who doesn't like an evil painting? Okay, so that's gonna be a ow. Oh, that's a hell of an uppercut. Well done. So as long as your fireballs only go sideways, I'm okay. Uh, let's take a breather. Left, right, and up, huh? There are some of these, though. There we go. Oh! Shoot! <laughs> Whoops. Not sure that was a good thing exactly. Oh, I almost got him. <laughs> and hop. We're gonna pass.
pass him. We'll pass this first. Let's just take you out of the equation so I don't have to worry about you. One thing is enough. Oh. Oh, that's hard. Ah, oh, darn it. Oh. <laughs> we might be here a bit. Gotta nail this. Oh, look at that. Three. Oh, oh, never mind. I lied. We won't be here long at all. <laughs> you know, sometimes you just... Just luck into a, a nice shot. Okay, good way to know if the paintings are going to be hostile when you can't move through them. Just a real piece of advice I just gave to no one but me! Okay, those are bad. Everything here is bad and wants to kill me. That's a red skull. Skull appears to be laughing. Oh, good for it. I'm glad it's having a good time. Please, please stop. Thank you. Just keep shooting him in the ankles. Hell appears to be laughing. Alright, that's all we got. Is that a... It's a little Bomberman Jr. who's firing diamonds? Oh, but we can kill him. Alright, good. That's all I need to know. Up. Nope, back up. Back up. Nope. And down. Down, please. Nope. She's down. Nope. Ah! Everything's going wrong. All gone bad. Birds. Oh god, so many of them. Yay! There we go. Yep. Back it up. Okay. It's gotta be. I'm about to say one lone painting. That's a trap. Where are we going? Whoop. Okay, and we're through there. Ooh! A thing! The black sachet. Uh black sachet. Heavily increases attack power at the risk of losing hit points. Huh. It's scent might induce sudden frenzy. Alright, so I think it does what the Tainted Missive does, but kind of on its own. We gotta keep Backman Patch, because holy cow, that worked great. Uh, once we use its other thing, then we'll switch to the Seed. And uh, the Magnet is still doing the job. We haven't needed Drill Arrows yet. Alright. Murder House is a music genre now. I mean, it really should be. Oh, the, oh boy, it's a mimic. Closer we the, okay, we're gonna go drop by the save point on our way back through here. Yep, you will not have me today. Nailed it. Alright, so now I wanted, I wanted to go up. Ladder. This time we'll go up and to the right. Gotcha. Boing! Painting. Oh, that's right, we unlocked a, a second level of charge. Oh, I love Neptune a lot. Do? Just fine. I really underused the bow in this game, and that's that's kind of a crime because it's a great weapon. We even got a, a couple of crest fragments that, like, improve. I hate that that one went all the way up and then back down again. Aw. Oh. They're falling out of the desk. It's so sad, and I'm the worst. Let's wait for this to charge all the way up. We'll just hit you from a safe distance. Seems to be the way to go. Alright, so we want to go up and then either to the right or to the left. Uh, I think that skeleton just walked through a secret door that I didn't know was there. You are not nearly as threatening as your friend with the giant cloud sword. Take the fowls out of everything and then put them back where you want. Look at that! Thanks, skeleton, for finding us that place. Awesome. Permit herd. <laughs> Permit hood. I love it.
the, even, the bird even looks sad. It was facing the wrong way. Now I'm sad. Alright, so we go left here. This is kind of a... Looks like it ought to be a dead end of some kind. Cat. Hop. Still don't know what the eggs do, but sometimes they give me money, so... Uh, let's go back to Kaho. Sorry, I lost you in the explosion of your sibling. Which sounds horrible now that I say it. What is this? This looks like a thing, right? I'm not mad. Looks like a desk that would have important things at it. Oh! I rebug! Like, they're not gonna put a whole room in here for nothing. I mean, maybe they are. I'm not their mom. Let's check one last thing. That wasn't one. How about over here? Uh -huh. No. Nope. Alright. Learning that there are not just secret walls that you can can break and go through, but that there are like secret walls that you can just straight up walk through that are invisible walls or visible non-walls, I guess you would say, uh, has really messed me up because now there's that much more game that at some point I would need to explore if I wanted to like 100% this thing, which I probably won't do. But if I did, I'd be at this all day. Ow! Hell, a wind up you got there, friend. You know what, this has worked out great, so we're gonna do it again. They hop together. It's, uh, it's like a Fortuna reference. Painting stopped on the side, so I thought it was dead. Alright, so you can stun a painting, which is a real thing that I just said. Here we go. Go. Yeah, I got you. What's this? Sealed. <gasps> Sealed wind! So there was a thing back in Karst City that wanted us to, to plug that into it for some reason. Alright. Let's hop down here. Woo! Thank you, slime blocks. You're my favorites. Ah, uh, ooh, this just looks like death. And it almost was. Here. Oh crap! Eh. Well, we have our thousand gold, so I can get my poison arrows, which is nice. Um, bigger problem is that we only have one battle flower left, so if we die out here, we're boned. Ooh. Come on, arrow. Charge. It's like a horror movie. Here we go. Oh, nope. Not today, Satan. Thank you for your slow-moving fireball. Ow. Not slow-moving enough. Get stunned. Alright, so we're doing okay? Ow. That's a lot of... That's a lot of casters. Please. Please. Two rooms away from the save point. This is not. This is not good. This is real not good. Uh, that's one safe room, I guess. Yes. Okay. Now safe. Room. Aha! That's where that room opens from. Aha! Out. That was a terrible idea. That's also not what I wanted. Do that. That worked better than I could have anticipated. Eh? It's not a bug. It's another. <laughs> Another backwards door. Where does that one come from? It must go... Must have to go down and around, I guess? Sure. Yeah. -ha. None for you. Getting the spikes. Yeah! I love that spikes also kill enemies in this game. It's a nice little bit of parody. I'm just not used to. There we go. Yeah. Aha. Oop ha! Nailed it! Uh, let's go right first. We can come back. Ever? Ever. What do you do? You do that. Oof. Get stun locked. Move, move. Please. A little faster, a little faster. Aha! Alright, so 
there's a little bit more of whatever this is. Please don't be a boss. Please don't be a boss. You're gonna be a boss. You're gonna be a boss! Oh, we're in trouble. Hi, who are you? I like your hat thing. You were the one who engaged with Fennel. Yeah, that was me. Turn back now for... I. Hey, first of all, rude. Second of all, I would love to. You're not gonna let me, though, are you? Her Highness does not want to be disturbed. From what I've been hearing, she's already pretty disturbed. Such impudence. Magnolia! Like, is that your name? Are you summoning someone? Or is that, like, your your charge? Nope, that you're summoning someone. Oh. Oh, this is bad. Oh, this is very bad. Oh, boy. Uh, ooh. It's fine. Everything's fine? It's not fine. It's terrible. Ow. Ooh. Ow. Magnolia hits like a truck. Not a good truck. Move, move. So I'm glad we found the save point before I made the mistake coming here. I'm doing very badly. Yeah, I keep dodging right into her. Oh, you can block that. Huh? Yeah, we're we're just we're dead. We're super duper dead. Oh, we got her to half health. <laughs> Actually got impaled on her little bunny helmet. It's kind of sad. Yep, we're dead. Okay, well we got her below half on the first try, uh, which is not bad, really, when you think about it. So now we know that that way lies boss battle. I don't think we have enough time to figure that one out in four minutes, but we do have enough time, I think, to go use the, the green box thingy. find out whatever this secret is all about. Hop, hop. Hop, hop. Hop. Gotcha. I think it's up here? I don't know. I don't remember. Who remembers things, honestly? Who has that kind of time? Where was the magic box? Is it over here? It's kind of on its own somewhere. What I meant to do. Just, okay, it's definitely not in this area. Can't be up there because I can't get up there. Not down there because that was the health fragment. Down left, let's go left. By which I mean let's go up. <laughs> puppy drool, puppy hungry. Yeah. Yeah. They could be nice puppies. Uh, that's the Curse Crest, so it couldn't be there. Because I wouldn't have been able to get to it before, and I definitely got to it before. So maybe it's this way past the thing? We're going to do a little bit of roaming for a moment. As Andy tries to remember where one specific secret fixture was. Nope, definitely not there. Alright. Almost got you in time. And through. Alright, so it's in... The the area that it's in looks like this. So if we've gone to the hotel, we've gone too far. But I think if... Can't be up there. Could be all the way back here somewhere? No, no. It has to be Karst City somewhere. All right, we're gonna go through and then up and around. And that'll be where we end the stream once we figure out the solution to this mystery. And through. So it looked like that first area. Whoop. The Karst City area, as opposed to this, which I call a Creepy Hotel. Probably has a name, but I don't know what that name is. I, okay, yeah, it looks like this. Maybe it is up here? I think I can... I hate that I can't dodge roll out of it. Ow! Combo. I also hate that I'm very bad at video games. Alright, let's try this one more time. I think I know the screen we need to be on now. So we can... Go up here. I think. A lot of guesswork. A lot of guesswork involved in this. I know I've seen it. We've seen it this playthrough even. We clicked up on it, and it was like, do you have a green box? And I'm like, no, we don't. 
Maybe I'm wrong. Was this not the car's crest? No, this is totally crest. Okay. That must be over here. Thank you for spacing yourselves out just right. Next screen. Okay, I think it is up here. I think it's up top. sink. Yep. Am I sure we can get over here? No. I'm confident we can do that, right? It looks like we should be able to do that. Maybe it's over here. Alright, we're gonna keep going. We'll run a little bit long because I'm determined to end this on a confident note. Yep, hi! Still not scared? Still not scared. Good. One little bright spot of hope in all this. Aha! Yes, okay, so this is back to looking like the Karst City outline. I think this is where we ran into the dude who told us about the cat lady. Kinda hate that that doesn't Indiana Jones those guys, but that's alright. Oop, hey, and we're through. Yes, okay, this is probably it. Ah! Yeah, yep, there it is, found it. Okay, so. Need the wind box. Uh, oh, it's one of these. Okay. So it's an active thing. Uh, you, I guess that. Oh, it's a windmill! Oh, it opened up the cat thing. Okay, got it. The cat door. The secret cat door. What does that give? Inspect. Ba the maple leaf in hibisco tea. Let's pretend that's a sentence. I think it means bathe the maple leaf in hibisco tea. Tea leaf. Got fresh spring leaf. We upgraded our sword. This blessed leaf is able to purify the source of the curse. Well, I'm glad we came back and did this. Holy crap. Remember, Baba is tea. Oh, okay. So we, oh boy. Yeah, it's gonna be tough. Uh. Yeah, I don't think I could have gotten out of that fast enough. Yeah, please. Please allow me to. Uh, but now we have not only a, uh, a stronger leaf, which is really cool, um, but we have a leaf that can purify? So maybe we don't have to kill the queen, we can just purify the queen? Which I realize sounds bad when I say them those words like that, but like, as opposed to lethal, ow, lethal ending, that could be cool. Also, it's green now, which is dope. I think it does more damage? It's hard to tell. The important thing is it's a purification thing. Hi there. Royal court, yada yada, same thing as before. Okay, just making sure. Cool. Well, um that's uh that's what we're gonna do. <laughs> I'll teach you eyes, Gov. No need to kill. Nice. <laughs> do you say anything different now that I met your boss? Partner's older sibling has returned. Oh? She's one of the court authorities on behalf of the convent. Perhaps you'll be interested in meeting her. Okay, so... So Fennel's sister has returned. We're just going to run through here. We're just going to get to a safe point at this point. That's where we're going to wrap up for tonight once we get to the nearest bell. Uh, and then next time, uh, next Saturday, there it is, we will wrap the whole thing up. Um, we got uh, we got a queen to, to save slash beat up. Um, once we, we beat up her, like twin enforcer deputy people in that fight that we died in a minute ago uh so yeah that's what we're gonna that's what we're gonna do probably gonna stream <laughs> watch puppies too awesome so in a bit head over to uh to xenon fiber it'll get auto hosted here so you'll just you know stay right where you are you'll get redirected that way for the the wonderfully named watch puppies 2 also known as watch dogs 2 um I've never played Watch Dogs 1, and I haven't heard good things, but I played Watch Dogs 2, and I love the living crap out of it. The characters are colorful and wonderful and so good. Um, and also, uh, Xenon and I agree on Marcus's attire, uh, that being the pride shirt that I just never had him take off. It was probably dungeon and grimy by the end of the game, but I don't care. It still glowed like a rainbow, and that's the important thing. Um, so I highly recommend checking that out. Otherwise, we'll be back here tomorrow night, thunderstorms permitting, I guess, with uh, A Plague Tale Innocence. Uh... Tuesday, we're starting something new, Sea of Solitude, which just came out yesterday. Uh, we're picking that up Tuesday, so that should be fun to watch. I hope. We'll find out. Thursday is more Remember Me. Saturday, we'll wrap this up. And that's the whole week. 
have a great week, everybody. Have a great weekend. Um, you know, first one, then the other. And uh, we'll catch you around for the next one.